Just outside the sleepy suburb of Loomis Falls lies a house shrouded in darkness and mystery. Holland House. This crumbling Victorian manor has cast a sinister shadow over the town for decades, hiding unimaginable secrets within its decaying walls. Once a grand estate built in the early 1900s for a wealthy family, Holland House has become the source of terrifying rumors and legends about unspeakable acts said to have occurred here. Owned for years by the reclusive Bartholomew Holland, the property developed a foreboding reputation after a string of children began disappearing from Loomis Falls without a trace in the 1940s. Though never charged, whispers spread that Holland may have been involved, luring the kids to meet a grisly fate behind the estate's walls. In 1954, the small town was rocked by the disappearances of three more young children, 12-year-old Rachel Lee, 8-year-old Tomas Ortega, and 10-year-old Ayana Grina over just a few months. Desperate search parties scoured the nearby Temperley Forest as the names of the missing were printed on flyers papering the streets. One resident claimed to have spotted a tall, slim man matching Bartholomew Holland's description lurking near one of the children before she vanished. Though police searched the estate, no evidence was found to make an arrest. The mysteries and tensions surrounding Holland House erupted again in 1962. Several children narrowly escaped reported abduction attempts in the woods around the property, allegedly by a man fitting Holland's description. But still, authorities could not build a solid case against the estate's owner. Decades later in 1982, a lone child confessed to having been briefly trapped inside Holland House as a young girl. She gave a disturbing account of witnessing horrible scenes play out before blacking out, unable to escape the home's clutches. But with no physical proof to corroborate, her story was dismissed as an overactive imagination. Finally, in 2004, Bartholomew Holland, by then known ominously as Old Man Holland, died alone at age 80 in the decrepit manner he never left. The estate has remained vacant since, left to rot like the sinister legacy it represents. Some locals insist Old Man Holland's malevolent spirit still dwells in those dark woods and inside the home's dilapidated halls, perhaps driven by guilt or depravity to linger. They spin bone-chilling tales of his ghost luring stray children too close so he can restart his reign of terror from beyond the grave. To this day, parents in Loomis Falls warn young kids to steer clear of the forest's edge and the decrepit Holland House at all costs. Just stories to scare them. Or could the mansion's deteriorating walls still be containing horrors we can't begin to fathom? The decades of mysteries and macabre events surrounding Bartholomew Holland leave more questions than answers about who or what may have fallen victim to the evil forces lurking here.